Hi friends, welcome to Sketchware Tutorials and in this video I am going to show you how to add login activity on your Android app. Most of the applications today have an authorization system in the form of Facebook login, Google login or simple plain email login. Having a login activity system in your Android app have a great way to keep users organized. Today we will learn how to create a basic login system with a simple login and sign up activity on your Android app. Let's open the app Sketchware and start the new project. I am going to name it as login. That's it. And here I want three pages or what I mean to say three activities for this app one for login activity and another for sign up activity and the other for uh, welcome screen so i'm gonna add three pages i'm gonna name it as sign up and another for welcome that's it and now this is the main activity and here I want to greet the user so I am going to take text view and let me change this text view to welcome to my app that's it and let me change layout gravity to center horizontal center vertical gravity to center horizontal center vertical that's it welcome to my app and here uh, the user has to take two options one is login and another is sign up so for that i am taking a linear horizontal two linear horizontal layouts and that's it let me take this text view another text view and i will take an edit text another edit text and let me change this text view to username that's it and this two sorry password password that's it and here I'm gonna change this to 25 SP and let me change this hint to enter username that's it and same thing with password also let me change this hint to enter password that's it i'm gonna name to this also fun face p text size to fun face ps and here i'm taking two buttons one for login and another for sign up if the user already sign up in this app then he has to log in or he has to sign up that's it login login that's it and let me change layout width to match parent that's it and let me change this should sign up layout with to match parent this to fun sp and let me change the text to cancel cancel let me change the text to sign up that's it and let me change this edit text to fun sp that's it it's looking good now and as you can see now um, as the user has to first take up the sign up action since the user will have to go through sign up process i'm gonna action i'm gonna lay out this sign up action same thing here i'm taking the two linear layouts and two text views and two edit text and here i'm take one button itself as the user has to sign up this process and let me change this text to 
further let's choose the name and let me change this to 25 sp and similarly password also let me change this to password one face p let me change hindi to enter username enter password that's it and the button now let me change this to sign up that's it and now let's go to the welcome activity and here uh, what you want to present to the user that is your app uh, what is your app idea here here from uh, your app idea are going to start i'm just uh, want to greet the user so i'm taking this text view and let me change this to welcome to the app that's it they would grab it and hold and vertical grab it and hold and vertical that's it welcome to the app that's it this is the simple logic section and as the user has to go through the same process first so i'm going to take logic of synapse pack to now first we're going to sign up we're going to finish the logic of sign up activity and here is this is the button one the sign up button and to share to save the username and password uh, you have to use this uh, file shared preferences so i'm going to name this file and i'm going to name it as user that's it and then i'm add this file shared preferences shared locally in your uh, system so that uh, whenever user has to press this sign up and login activity he has to retrieve the information from the phone and uh, he has to sign up or login activity so when button one is clicked uh, uh, when button one is clicked if follow the logic if zero greater than length of get text edit text one that is username and zero greater than zero greater than length of a text to is greater than then go to the component go and file set data key value here i'm gonna set the key to the username itself and i'm gonna take this password that is edit text to uh, to get text why i'm gonna use this because uh, i'm gonna map username and password to through uh, a map this is called a map and this creates a one to one relationship between username and password and uh, as you can see this is finished and let's go to the intent section intent i and let's go to the intent set screen login activity and activity and let's finish this activity present now and you have to show the message 
to the user that sign up is complete. That's it. And uh, if zero is greater than um, length of this is not possible, then you have to show the message. Cancel. Yes, exactly. Let me take this if else block here and if else block here and here. I'm gonna place this and I'm gonna place this. That's it. Else, you have to show the message to the user that enter valid inputs that's it and simply finish it and let's the sign up logic is complete and let's move to the main activity which is nothing but this main.xml and here here also i'm gonna add file shared references and i'm gonna name the same file which is entered by the sign up activity there i name it as user so here also i'm gonna use it the user and i'm gonna use an intent i and as you can see here uh, when the user presses the sign up button he has to move to the sign up page so go to this intent set screen and let's go to sign up activity start activity and presently finish this activity that's it and when button one is clicked that is when the user presses the login page uh, if the same process and length of and get text that's it where is it And simply copy it and paste it over here if zero greater than length of this edit text one and edit text two zero greater than length of edit text That's it. If zero greater than then only you have to go to this file component and I'm gonna take another if block here. If equals go to file component file get data key file and here I'm gonna take this U component here is it get text username that is edit text one is equal to the get text edit text two password then only has to move to the welcome page Set screen welcome activity and start the activity and let's finish the present activity now and if it is not matches then the user enter the wrong password then show the message wrong password that's it and if it is not zero uh, if it is not greater than zero then we have to show the message enter valid inputs that's it the logic section is also complete and uh, we don't want to 
we don't want this welcome page that's it uh, here here from your app starts uh, i'm just leaving this page to your wish and let's run the app and let's see whether it is working or not uh, let's compile it let's run and as you can see now uh, it shows me two options um, i did not sign up for any account now so i'm going to press this sign up activity and here i migrated to the sign up page and now i'm going to sign up i'm going to name is username is sketchware and password to be abc that's it and simply press the sign up button and as you can see sign up is complete but there is a mistake here and now i'm going to rectify this mistake good sign up activity and when button one is clicked remove this finish dot activity let's go to the main activity also finish this activity sign up button one finish activity <coughs> that's it and here as you can see uh, when i enter the password the password has visible to the user so i'm gonna not too visible to the user so let me change the property of it now main dot xml and here i'll change this to text password password of this and the same thing with this also i'll change this input type to text password and let's run the app and let's update the app now and as you can see now uh, i am on welcome activity i want to press sign up activity and i did the same thing sketch where and here uh, initially without updating the app uh, you have to show the password but now you did not see the password um, i made the password daikodai this is my name and i simply press the sign up activity and here as you can see sign up is complete but uh, is not moving backwards so something there is a mistake here and let me finish this do that when sign up dot activity is clicked you have to go to the main activity yes here i forgot to start the activity that's it and let's update the app now install i think there is no mistakes now here as you can see i previously um, sign up for the activities now i'm gonna log in with that i made the username and password and simply log in and as you can see now uh, i'm showing the message welcome to the app he, here onwards your activity is going to be start that's it for today guys thank you for watching my video please like and subscribe for more videos like this in the next video i'm gonna show you how to add a forgot password activity and change password activity to this app so stay tuned to my channel thank you